Hi, I'm Connie Cooley with Baker Electric Home Energy. We are proud to be a certified Tesla Powerwall installer, and we want to thank you for choosing us to install your Tesla Powerwall. Now that you have your Tesla Powerwall installed, it's time to go through all the amazing features that your Tesla Powerwall app has for monitoring your energy consumption and your energy production if you have a solar system. After your installation, you should have received an email to register your Tesla account. If you have a Tesla vehicle, you will be able to use the same app for all your Tesla products. If you have not been registered, please call the Tesla Registration and Mobile App Troubleshooting Line at 877-798-3752. Simply download the app on your mobile device. Once the app is installed and open on your smart device, the Tesla Powerwall home screen shows you updates on the overall status of your system and whether you are charging or discharging. If you have solar and Powerwall, both are visible. But if you only have Powerwall, the solar will not be visible. The first option on the bottom menu is the power flow option. This reveals how much power is generated from your solar panels and the direction your energy is flowing to your home, power wall, or the grid. If your solar system is producing more power than the home and power wall can use, that power will be exported back to the grid. Power wall will not export power back to the grid by itself. You can touch the solar, home, power wall, or grid icons to access more information, or you can select the graph icon at the top. Selecting this gives a more detailed breakdown of how you are producing and using energy. You can have all of the different components of your system laid over one another to get the full view of your system, or you can go through each aspect of your system individually. This first graph in blue shows your home energy consumption. Energy spikes in the morning and evening are normal. This is when you are waking up and starting your day, or at night you are making dinner, watching TV, or perhaps charging your EV. Scrolling down shows the energy breakdown from your solar system, the power wall, and the grid. If you touch the solar icon, you can see the solar production for the day. As you scroll down, you will see how much solar energy was produced and where it was used. Next, let's select the power wall icon. The graph shows on the left side the power wall energy distribution during the night. As we begin generating solar power, some of the energy is used by the home and the surplus is used to charge power wall. This is reflected by the green curve dropping below the x-axis. The sharp end of the curve shows that the power wall has reached its full charge, and now your system can export energy back to the grid. Then in the evening, after the sun goes down, the power wall automatically starts discharging. The positive green curve shows how much energy the power wall is now sending to your home. Now, let's look at the grid icon. You will notice that the gray grid goes into the negative, this indicates that after the power wall was fully charged, the extra power from solar was fed back to the grid. You can also verify in the latter half of the day, the power wall supported your home and you did not have to use any utility power. Let's go back to the home menu. Select the second option, performance. This helps you understand how much of your home energy needs were self-produced from solar and power wall versus what energy was pulled from the grid. If you select yesterday, you can see where your energy came from and see that you are relying less on utility power. The backup history options let to see how many times there was a utility outage. Powerwall instantaneously switches over and provides backup energy during an outage. Here, you can see the day and time that the power outage happened. The bottom menu gives you the customization option. This screen reveals a menu of modes to choose from, which can include backup only, self-powered, and advanced time-based control. In backup only mode, your backup reserve is set to 100%, and your power wall will prioritize charging from any available solar or grid energy. In other modes, you will be able to customize your backup reserve percentage. In self-powered mode, the power wall will store solar energy during the day and discharge at night. Advanced time-based control is a great option for customers on time of use. If you have a power wall without solar, there is only a single advanced time-based control mode available. 
The time-based control mode continuously runs an energy audit on your system. It learns the patterns of your energy use, forecasts seasonal solar production, and takes into consideration your time of use rates. This smart forecast is why time-based control will not show as an option within the first 24 hours of installation. Time is needed to learn about your energy use. After 24 hours of being installed, choose from the two modes of operation, balanced and cost saving. Both modes shift energy from inexpensive times to expensive times. Select balanced to discharge during all times of use periods. This may minimize energy export during off-peak times, balancing your power reserves for other times in the day. Select cost saving to maximize your credits for sending energy back to the grid and making sure to leave charge space in your power wall for any excess solar energy production. Use edit price schedule to set the peak and off peak times to match your utility rate plan. You can also set a different schedule for the week and weekends. Keep in mind that it takes up to one hour for the power wall to adapt to any changes that you make in these modes. Severe weather is the leading cause of power outages. Stormwatch mode allows you to keep a reserve percentage in self-powered or time-based control mode. Powerwall communicates with the National Weather Service to know when severe weather is on the horizon and automatically triggers Stormwatch. This mode charges Powerwall to maximum capacity so it can provide backup power in the event of an outage. When activated, the Tesla app will notify you that you are now in Stormwatch mode. This remains active until the weather event ends. After, the system will return to its previously selected mode. Although you cannot turn on Stormwatch or adjust it, you can disable this mode altogether by adjusting the slider next to Stormwatch. The Tesla app allows you to manage all of your Tesla products from anywhere. As Tesla introduces new feature enhancements, Baker Electric Home Energy will keep you updated. Be sure to check out these updates and answers to other questions you may have at our website at bakerhomeenergy.com or if you have any further questions, please feel free to call us at 877-578-8080.